A chilling wind blows, whispers of the unknown echo in the night. Welcome to a journey into the shadows, into the tales that lurk in the corners of the Philippines. Prepare for the top 10 dark urban legends that have haunted this island nation for generations, starting with our 10th entry. At number 10, we have the White Lady of Balete Drive. This spectral woman, dressed in all white, is said to hitch rides with unsuspecting drivers, only to disappear once they reach her destination. A chilling reminder to always check the rearview mirror. Moving to number 9, the tale of Maria Labo, a story of a woman turned into a monstrous creature after consuming human flesh. She wanders the night, searching for her next meal, her face marked by a large, gruesome scar, hence her name. At number 8, we delve into the legend of the Mananangal. This horrific creature detaches its upper body from its lower half and flies into the night, hunting for its favorite meal, human hearts and fetuses. A gruesome tale that has been part of Filipino folklore for centuries. For our seventh entry, we encounter the Tikbalang, a creature with the body of a man and the head and hooves of a horse. It is said to lead travelers astray, forever lost within its twisted forest home. Number six introduces us to the Aswang, a shape-shifting monster. By day, it appears as a regular human, but by night, it transforms into a bloodthirsty beast, seeking out victims to satisfy its hunger. Halfway through our list at number five, we meet the ghostly soldiers of Corregidor Island. Witnesses claim to hear gunfire and see apparitions of soldiers. A chilling reminder of the island's bloody past during World War II. At number four, we have the eerie tale of the headless priest. This decapitated specter is said to wander church grounds, forever searching for his lost head, a chilling sight for those unfortunate enough to cross his path. Our third most terrifying legend is that of the Black Bride. This vengeful spirit haunts her former home, cloaked in a black wedding dress. She terrifies those who dare to live within her domain, forever mourning her lost love. The second most horrifying legend is the tale of the Balete tree. This ancient tree is believed to be the dwelling place of powerful spirits, and anyone who dares to harm it suffers dire consequences. And now, the most terrifying of them all, at number one, the legend of the Tong Ahas, or Snake Man. This half-human, half-snake creature is rumored to live beneath a popular shopping mall, preying on unsuspecting shoppers a tale that continues to strike fear into the hearts of many. In summary, the top three most terrifying urban legends discussed are the Black Bride, her haunting presence a chilling reminder of lost love turned vengeful, the Balady Tree, an ancient dwelling place for powerful spirits that punish those who dare harm it, and the most horrifying of them all, the Taong Ahas, a creature of nightmares that lurks beneath a bustling shopping mall ready to snatch its prey. These tales, woven into the fabric of Filipino culture, serve as a reminder of the unknown, the unexplained, and the terrifying. So the next time you find yourself in the Philippines, remember, not everything is as it seems, and some tales are more than just stories.